Hello everyone, welcome to the fourth of our newsletters and again it's back to me to update you on our progress so far. We've held uh, open days at all of our services and they've been well attended in some cases, not so well in others. But one thing that we've heard is that you don't just want open days running one month, you want them running all the time. So we're going to have open days running in all of our services right the way through to August and September and we'll get dates to you when they're going to be held as soon as we possibly can. Uh, it's really important that you come and speak to us if you want to phone me, if you want to come and visit you as a group, an individual, and if you're a parent, family or carer, just tell me. And however I can accommodate seeing you over the next few weeks, I'd really like to do so. Because what you say really matters and what you can tell us is going into our business case and our business plan. We're not so good at the moment at getting written materials to you. In many cases you've told us we haven't given you enough, enough, enough notice about events. And that's, that's, that's not good enough. So the more dialogue we have, the more notice we give you, the more ways by which we try to communicate, I think is the only way that we're going to guarantee that we've all had the opportunity to speak to us and we've given you every opportunity to tell us what you need to, and tell us what is working, tell us what isn't working, so that we can not lose sight of any, key, any of the key messages that will make this business the success we know it can be. One thing that we have done is held uh, a staff away day. And you all, as members of our team, contributed to workshops and you gave suggestions for what we needed to do, things that we needed to think about, things that were working really well. Um, and you also told us one of the, some of the things that we have to get right from day one. We've made a decision also regarding staff pensions. So all of our existing staff will come over with their terms and conditions as they are. Absolutely no change whatsoever. Um, and also we have the first design of our website, which you know we won't have the, um, the greatest services um, uh, in, in, in crystal buildings and with glass frontages and various other exciting things from day one. We have some great services of course but we also have some old old fashioned services um, and old fashioned buildings. What we want to do though is make sure that we have a really really state of the art website and a platform for people to talk to us um, online, uh, for our staff to use online, for people to book services from us and book support from us and we want that to be designed with you. So we're looking for a group of you, probably 50, people that use services, parents, carers, our staff, commissioners, social workers, and anyone else that wants to help us trial and design these, these pages for our website before they go live, because they've got to work for everyone. And that's really exciting, because it's our, it's our brand for the first time getting out there online and being used by a different, wider audience. So we've been busy, we've got a lot to do, and I'll speak to you again probably in a couple of weeks. Thank you.